Hey guys, how you doing? Steve here again today. First of all, I'd just like to say that um, I know in my previous videos I mentioned I was getting married. There it is, guys. It happened. Uh, I'm a husband now. I have a wife. I survived my wedding. You know, it was a tough day, but um, I really enjoyed myself, and um, I was happy to have a lot of friends and family and. To officially become a, a, a member of um, my new family, you know, some great people who've helped me through this this tough time, you know. Um, but I promised you guys an update <clears throat> as far as my what my my blood results and how I was going to see a functional medicine practitioner. So my blood results came back, you know, my tyrosine was fine, my phenylalanine was fine. Um, Niacin, my vitamin B3, B3 levels were fine, and um, basically everything checked out except my serotonin levels dropped from 31 to 22 nanograms per milliliter. Uh, I just got out of my appointment, my free one hour consultation with a functional medicine practitioner, and it was... Um, <clears throat> You know, for about a half hour we spoke, and for about 15 minutes, um, it was a physical examination, and I had a lot of poking and prodding around my gut, around my chest, um, my head, and some around my legs, <clears throat> and um, he basically told me that he can, just by feeling my gut, that I, that I have some issues going on, and that... Um, he definitely thinks he can help me. And it was nice that he told me that if he didn't think he could help me, that he would let me know. And then um, he would refer me to somebody who would be more knowledgeable. So I said, um, one of the first questions he asked me is, why am I here? And I told him because I've tried medicines, I've tried therapy, you know, I've tried everything I can think of. And, um, I've, you know, I finally got down the road to try out a functional medicine practitioner, so here I am. I showed him all my blood work. I um, told him my story on how I've been dealing with this for the last year, you know, the ins and the outs of everything, and he took a look at my blood work, and he said that I have a great doctor, and that most people don't even know what these things are, and most people don't even know what to test for them. And I laughed, and I said, my doctor didn't know what half of them were, and I'm the one that suggested that I want the blood work tested. And he said, really? I said, yeah. I said, I've been doing a lot of research, but there's too much, too much out there for me to piece together. There's too much out there for me to fully grasp and understand because there's so many different opinions and so much more science behind what's going on with my depression, my anxiety that I can't fathom, I can't grasp the full idea, the full answer. So I needed some more professional help. So it was a relief to hear that he told me he um he became a functional medicine practitioner because when he was 20 years old he had anxiety and he had a slight form of depression and he went to the doctors and they suggested SSRIs and he refused them. And they basically just told him if he doesn't want medications to just go home and eat chicken soup. And it was kind of refreshing because the guys that I've been watching on YouTube, the articles that I've been reading about functional medicine practitioners they're all the same they want to find out what's going on for themselves and they want to find out why the, why the fuck they're not getting better you know what the fuck is wrong with them and this guy did the same and then this is what I'm going to be trying to do once I once I heal I want to be in that guy's shoes I want to help people out tremendously and find the root cause of their problems and I'm hoping and I'm praying that this is it, guys. I'm hoping that 
I finally find my answers. You know, he, he told me that he's 99% sure I have adrenal fatigue. Something's wrong with my adrenals. Um, there's definitely gut problem, problems going on. He told me that there's a lot of serotonin produced in my gut. And he can tell just by feeling my stomach, you know, feeling my chest, um, my upper abdomen, that I have some, some problems going on. And he wants to address them. And they, I have to go through a series of tests. I start tomorrow. I told him I want to get the ball rolling. I said I've been out of work, you know, since November. I want to get get back into work. I want to feel healthy again. I want to feel happy again. And I just want to want to get started. Um, now, unfortunately, this comes with a cost, guys. The insurance doesn't really cover um, functional medicine. You know, um, I wish that it did. And I'm hoping, and one thing I'm going to push for when I get better is to have it cover functional medicine. I want insurance companies to know that it's, there's more out there to to heal patients, to heal people than more than just medications. And, you know, um, that's what I'm going to be pushing for. You know, um, I was pretty happy with um, with this guy. You know, he seemed a little bit older than I was. Which I was, which I've been looking for. I've been looking for somebody who is more knowledgeable, who is newer to medicine. And, you know, it's like I said before, you can't teach an old dog new tricks. You know, I don't think that these older doctors know the newer practices of how to, how to treat depression, how to treat anxiety, how to treat a lot of different things. And what cofactors and precursors and what ins and outs happen to make somebody healthy again, you know? So, I, I'm all in for it, you know? I had to, uh, I'm going to be honest, it's going to cost $1,600 for the initial month where most of the treatment happens. And after that, I think it's about $400 a month. And he he told me he's going to be honest with me. He said, it sounds like I'm going to be a three-monther. He said some people are six, seven, eight-monthers. But he said that I'm not... He said that I've done so much research that... I can kind of grasp what he's saying and what's kind of going on in my body already. And um, that... With the knowledge that I have already, it won't be as long as a process because I've done my research, guys. You know, uh, I've tried with this channel to inform you guys of the research that I've done and the information, and you can watch in some of my previous videos. So, I apply for a, um, a, a, a no interest payment plan, you know, through something called Care, Care Connect. So, for the next 12 months I have to pay off $1,600 but if he's saying that I can get back to work within three months you know that's going to be no issue yeah uh, I've been waiting for somebody to be confident I've been waiting for somebody to know part of my French but I'm at the tail end of just being frustrated I've been waiting for somebody to know and truthfully tell me what the fuck is going on and what the fuck I can do you know, this shit has, has been long enough, and, you know, I did my I did my research, I did my reviews on this guy, I knew it was going to be a little costly, and I knew that functional medicine is wasn't really covered by insurance, I knew that going in, but fuck it, I've tried so much, so much else, you know, and I've tried the regular conventional medicine route, and it hasn't worked, guys. You know, nobody knows what the fuck I'm talking about, and nobody can give me an answer on what the fuck is happening. So, within a 15-minute evaluation, he can tell me that my adrenals are definitely having some problems. I have some inflammation in my intestines, and that's where a lot of serotonin is productive, guys. So, if you're out there and you you know your your medicine is not working properly, and you're still not feeling healthy, you're still feeling down in the dumps like me. 
ask a relative, ask anybody if you got some savings account. It's you're you're investing in your life. That's what I'm doing. I'm investing in bettering myself. You know, um, I mean, I told them, I said, listen, I'm not going to sign up for six months. I'm not going to sign up for three months. I'm going to sign up because I told you I'm skeptical about everything and I'm not going to, you know, put myself fully out there unless I know that I'm seeing results. You know, I'm not going to spend money and invest in myself, invest in, in you if I'm not seeing any results. And he said, I completely understand. He said, we'll do the first month. That's the most important and he said, try me from there. And he said, if you don't see results, then I promise you, I won't force you to go on for any more additional months. So I said, let's do it. I've read your reviews. You're excellent. Let's get the ball rolling. And, you know, I'm hoping that I'm going to start feeling better soon. So tomorrow I start my my treatment, my examinations, and the, the ball will continue to roll from there. And I will give you guys updates on what's happening. Um, I was told I'm going to be given supplements tomorrow. As far as their findings, I'm going to be tested against foods. And, you know, I'm going to see a nutritionist. It's um, a two-hour long process, which uh, a two-hour long examination. And my fingers are crossed, guys. Toes are crossed. Um, I'm all in, you know. I need to be able to be happy again. I need to be able to live again. I need to do it not just for me, but for my loved ones, for my friends, for my new wife. I need to feel better. And I'm going to do everything it takes. So, if you guys have any questions for me, you know, about how this functional medicine practitioner is working and um, why I decided to go this route, Shoot me a comment. Um, if you want to hear more updates and how I'm doing, subscribe to my channel, guys. And like I say all the time, please don't be afraid to reach out to me. I am more than open and honest to tell you how I'm feeling. And to if you need to, to vent, if you need to get things out, you know, just you can type ten pages. I'll read it all and I'll get back to you as, as much as I can. And um, I know that it's not easy, guys. It's It fucking sucks, you know, to be blatantly honest. And I just want to... <clears throat> I just want to be honest with you guys. It's That's the ugly truth of it, is it sucks. And I know that there's a different way now, a, a better way to end all of this. And I'm really hoping that this is the end. You know, of my pain and my suffering. So like I said, guys, if you're suffering, if you're hurting, if you're down today, you keep your heads up, you keep fighting, and you keep surviving. I hope you all feel well soon. Take care of yourselves. You know, take care of yourselves first before others. And uh, I'll talk to you guys in the next video.